friends here in this problem we will develop the law of machine from the data given i'll read the question in a certain lifting machine comma a load of 10 kilo newton is raised by an effort of 300 newton on this same machine a load of 20 kilo newton is lifted by an effort of 550 newton find the law of machine also calculate vr that is velocity ratio if efficiency is 75 percent this is the question i'll write the data what is given here in a certain lifting machine a load of 10 kilo newton is raised by an effort of 300 newton so load and effort values are given i'll write down the load as w1 it is 10 kilo newton so 10 into 10 raised to 3 newton by an effort of 300 newton so p1 it is 300 newton on this same machine a load of 20 kilo newton the second value of load 20 into 10 raised to 3 newton is lifted by an effort of 550 newton find the law of machine this is the question next also calculate vr velocity ratio if the efficiency is 75 percent so efficiency is given now the first part is for law of machine and it is very much understood that if two values of load and effort are given the problem is on law of machine so i'll write the solution since law of machine is given by the formula is p is equal to m into w plus c now i'll use the conditions which are given the first condition of load and effort so the first effort is 300 so 300 is equal to m into w it is 10 into 10 raised to 3 plus c i'll keep this as equation number one next the second condition effort is 550 so here i'll write down effort as 550 m into w is 20 into 10 raised to 3 plus c this is the second equation now if we see from equation 1 and 2 these are simultaneous equations and we will solve it i will change the sign here this becomes negative so c minus c plus c this gets cancelled out here i'll get minus 550 plus 300 that is minus 250 is equal to this will be minus 10 into 10 raised to 3 m from both the sides negative sign gets cancelled and therefore i will get the value of m it will be equal to 250 divided by 10 10 raised to 3 my answer is m is 0 0.025 now after getting m i'll say that put m in equation number one so i'll get the value of c so i'll say that after this therefore equation one is 300 is equal to m into 10 into 10 raised to 3 m is 0 0.025 into 10 into 10 raised to 3 plus c so therefore 300 is equal to this value is 250 plus c so hence c will be 300 minus 250 that is 50 once i get the value of m and c i'll say that hence law of machine it will be equal to p is equal to m into w m value is we have found out it was 0 0.025 so I'm developing this law of machine by putting the value of M into W plus C is 50 Newton 
so this is my first answer I have developed the law of machine now in the second part they are saying to calculate VR and efficiency is 0 0.75 so I'll say that since efficiency is equal to MA upon VR which is also equal to instead of MA I'll write down W upon P into VR since we have to calculate VR therefore I'll shift VR onto the other side in the denominator here I have W upon P efficiency will be in the denominator so finally W is given I can take any one of the case because mechanical advantage will remain constant so W is 10 I am taking 10 into 10 raised to 3 so for that I have to take the value of effort as 300 300 into efficiency is given as 0 0.75 so from this I will get my answer of VR which comes out to be 44.44 and this is my second answer so if we see in this problem we had to develop the law of machine that we have developed in answer number one then the next part was to calculate velocity ratio we have found it and with this the problem is completed